Hey everybody, it's Samantha and I'm back with a product review. Um, if you're wondering why I am outside on a giant dog bed, it is because I had to move this bed outside out of our home. Um, as you can tell from CD, it's hot out here today and um, they don't want to lay on a dark bed in the sun. I could not get them off of it while we were inside because this is usually down in my office, which is in our basement and it's nice and cool down there. Um, and I could not get them off it long enough to do a review. So we're outside. This is a big Barker dog bed. And you can see up here um, we have the headrest edition. So I will just say that I am five feet tall. Oh, Sadie's gonna land it. No, she can't. It's too hot. I am five feet tall. I can very comfortably lay on this bed with my dog. It's it's that big. Um, we have had this for um, a little over two weeks now, and I cannot tell you how amazing this bed is if you see my product reviews you know that i don't get excited about products very often um there's only been a handful of products that i've seen in the last couple of years that have really excited me as much as this big barker bed um so i'm going to tell you all about it there is so much to this bed um that i want to cover so i'm going to jump right into it uh the bed itself is made with an orthopedic foam and i'm going to take the cover off in just a minute to show you how easy that is. Um, but it's just a really, it's one piece of orthopedic foam under here. Um, and then you have the, the washable cover that goes over it. So that's definitely on top of my list when I'm looking for products for our dogs because our dogs are, um, actually you can see the dog hair and the drool and the dirt all over this already. Um, so I love products that are easy to clean. You can take the cover off this, it easily unzips. And again, I'll show you that in just a second. Um, throw it in the washing machine and then you can tumble dry it as well on low heat so um, very easy to clean if for some reason you have to clean the foam itself if your dog has an accident or something you can clean the foam with um, a mild detergent and then um, just wet the foam down and wring it out and then let it thoroughly dry I the company does say that you can do that I would not recommend that if at all possible obviously if your dog has an accident you're gonna have to um, but the problem is the foam gets wet and it gets so so heavy so um, and it, it rips really easily when it's that heavy so I would be leery about that of course if you need to you need to um, but the cover washes really easily so that's great um, and the foam can be washed uh, so this is on orthopedic foam and what that means is you can see that when I am laying on this bed um, and I'm not going to tell you how much I weigh but I am an adult so you know that I weigh over 100 pounds um, I probably weigh more than most large breed dogs and you can tell that this bed it is it's supporting me and it's going down just a little bit but I'm up off the floor and there's still inches of foam between me and the floor so when I get up off of this, all I'm doing is pushing into the foam. And if you think about it with your dog, if they lay on the floor or you have an older dog bed or a flat dog bed, um, you know, when they push off to get themselves off, their joints and their bones are pushing off of the hard floor. Whereas with the big Barker bed, I'm, I'm not. My elbow is pushing it down, but I'm pushing up off the bed, I mean off the foam instead of up off the hard floor. So that's a huge benefit for dogs with um, joint issues, bone issues, older dogs that are a little bit more lame or sore. Um, if your dog has Lyme disease or another condition where you know um, his joints are very sore, it's, it, he's lame and it's hard for him to get up and down, um, this is, is really, really wonderful for that. Um, not only that, but the, the orthopedic foam itself supports your dog in a different way than any other bed will. It gives them that support that they need while they're laying there. And whether your dog sleeps for eight hours a day or your dog sleeps for three hours during the day, this bed is going to give them the support that they need. And I don't want to make it sound like this bed is only good for older dogs or dogs with hip or joint issues. This is a great bed for any dog. If you're, if you have a puppy, instead of letting them wait six or eight years, before they start developing joint issues and you notice it and you buy them a quality bed, if you start out when they're a puppy, it's gonna do wonders for their joints throughout the course of their life and you might prolong those hip and joint issues for years by um, giving them supplements and providing them with a, a comfortable bed to lay on. Um, so orthopedic beds really have a lot of amazing benefits for your dog health-wise um, and then 
you know, not only that, of course, but it's comfortable. Like I said, our dogs won't get off this bed. We have um, our boxer Chloe, who's six, but she her her joint health is fine. She doesn't have any no lameness or soreness or anything like that. Um, and then, of course, we have two younger dogs. If you follow my videos, we have a one-year-old chocolate lab and then a small little beagle. And I think our beagle is on this more than um, our other dogs do. They they. Our dogs love this bed. I, I will honestly tell you that this is certainly a bed that they've laid on more than any other dog bed that we've ever had. Um, so I, I wrote things down here because I want to make sure that I get the numbers correct for you. Um, we got the giant size. There are three sizes of Big Barker beds. You can get the large, which is 48 inches by 30 inches by 7 inches tall. The extra large is 52 inches long, 36 inches wide, and 7 inches Tall. Um, and then the giant, which is what we have, is 60 inches. Um, no, sorry, this is the we have the extra large, which is the 52, um, 36, and 7. And then you can get the giant, which is 60 inches by uh, 48 inches by 7 inches tall. They come in three colors. Whether you get you can get the sleek, which is just a, a flat bed without this headrest. Um, it's just a regular rectangle, or you can get the headrest edition, which we have here. Um, and they all both the, both styles come in three different colors. They come in khaki, which is a tan color, uh, this chocolate color, and then a burgundy, which is a darker red. And um, we let me just say we got the headrest edition because we have a dog that loves to nest, and she loves to be up against something. When she sleeps on our bed, she sleeps on the pillows. On the couch, she's on the pillows. Um, if she's on blankets or something on the floor, she will nest them all up in a pile and kind of lean her body onto one side of it. Hey, buddy. So we got the headrest edition, and we find that all of our dogs like to lay with their heads on the headrest, which is funny because uh, our beagle always has done it too, but our chocolate lab never did that before she never laid with her head on anything so we kind of found that interesting about this but there's definitely an added comfort in that um and then the other thing that i like about these is like i said our boxer nests so she digs and digs and digs before she lays down she spins 15 circles and digs some more and then finally lays down and this cover after two weeks and when i tell you she nests every day multiple times a day anytime she lays down, that dog cannot lay down without nesting so she has nested on this multiple times a day every day for more than two weeks it shows no sign of wear no scratching um, it's a very very durable cover on this bed which I'm very impressed with because we've had other beds where she has ripped holes in other beds in days and I cut her nails it's not that her nails are long she just nests so much and um, like I said we've had other cheap beds that she's ripped within days so this has been really that's really important to us to find something with a durable cover um, as well so I will talk to you now a little bit about the one drawback to the big Barker beds and that is the price um, of course with anything that's really top quality and well made you know that there's going to be a catch uh, when you get to the register to pay for your item so uh, that is the downside of the big Barker bed as well if you get the sleek option, which is the flat bed with no headrest, they're a little bit cheaper. Uh, the headrests add to it, and of course it varies, the price will vary depending on the size of your bed. But if you get the smallest Big Barker bed, which is the large size, they only come in large, extra large, and giant because these are made for big dogs. Um, if you, <clears throat> excuse me, if you get the large size in sleek, it's a $200 dog bed. If you bump up to the headrest, it's $240. Um, if you go to the giant size, the sleek giant size is uh, $350, and the sleek, uh, sorry, the headrest edition giant size is a $400 dog bed. And I know that that sounds crazy. It sounded crazy to me at first. But first of all, you will save money long term because this is something that's going to benefit your dog's health like we had talked about. And second of all, these beds are guaranteed, guaranteed not to go flat as long as you, when you first get your bed, you register it online and then you are covered for 10 years, 10 years. So if you say you get the Big Barker Giant Headrest Edition, so you're buying a $400 dog bed, 
over 10 years, that's the equivalent of buying one dog bed that costs $40 every year. And I know because we've done it and I actually have one here to show you. Um, this was a good quality dog bed that I spent $50 on. We got this about six months ago. And as you can tell, there are parts of it that now have no stuffing left in it. There are parts that are nice and super thick. Um, it is lumpy, it's bumpy. When my dogs lay on it, it squashes right down to the floor. There are parts where, if you can hear that, I'm, I can knock on, the, on our deck through this. And you can't hear that with the big barker bed, obviously. Um, so I spent $50 on this. It lasted not even six months. So if you're spending $400 on a dog bed once, this is guaranteed. As long as you remember to get online and register your bed, it is guaranteed not to go flat for 10 years. And that's not even saying that after 10 years, it is going to go flat. You might get 11, 12, or more years out of it. So even if it does go flat after 10 years, you've spent $40 a year for your dog's comfort and for a decent, high-quality bed that benefits your dog's health as well. And I know, I, I understand that spending even for the lowest price of $200 on a dog bed is a lot of money for a dog bed. And I was blown away by that fact at first. Um, but you know, think about it over the long term for how how many benefits this bed gives your dog and how long it's going to last. It's really not a bad investment. It is something that you may have to squirrel money away for. It's certainly nothing that you're probably going to buy, run out and buy today, but it's something to keep in the back of your mind if it's something that you're interested in. Squirrel away a little bit of money here and there, and the next time your dog needs a new bed, you can grab the big barker, and you won't have to worry about another dog bed for 10 years at least, which I can't even fathom 10 years of the same dog bed because we've like that one we've always bought dog beds for $50 I we've bought dog beds before for $100 that haven't even lasted a year so t for me to think about not buying a dog bed for 10 years is unbelievable and I'm really looking forward to having this bed long term um so these are some of the uh, real high quality benefits of the big Barker bed. Um, I also do want to mention, like I said, these are made for the bigger dogs. You can get a smaller bed. Um, the foam that's in these is actually made to support heavier weights. So this bed is not made for smaller breeds. They do have a Barker Junior bed, which is made for dogs that are less than 50 pounds. Um, so if you have a small dog, like technically our Beagle, um, this isn't the right foam for her. The, the Barker Juniors are made with a different kind of foam that gives lighter dogs the support that their body requires as well. Uh, when our little beagle lays on this, she barely even makes an indentation in it because the foam is made to support dogs that weigh, um, you know, 80, 90, over 100 pounds. So if you have a smaller dog, they do have options for you. They don't make the big Barker in sizes less than large, um, but they do make the, the Barker Junior. Um, they also make a, a crate pad that's uh, about four inches thick, I think. So uh, if you kennel your dog and you want him to have something comfortable to lay on in his kennel, uh, that's always a good choice. And they have separate covers. You can buy additional covers. So if the cover does happen to get ripped or um, stained or you just want to um, interchange covers like while you're washing one, uh, put another one on or interchange like maybe you want the burgundy for um, to match your Christmas decor for the holiday season and, and the chocolate for um, the other months or whatever you want to do. They do sell the covers separately, uh, which is a nice feature as well. A lot of beds, uh, once you buy it, it comes with a washable cover and that's the only cover you have. Um, so that's a nice plus. Now, really quickly, I do just want to tip this up on its side. And again, I apologize for the dirt because my dogs are filthy. But um, I just want to show you that this just unzips. And it unzips all the way around. It unzips on the on that edge too. And then you can just peel the cover off. And you can see um, under here is the foam. And you take this off. You can throw it in the wash. And then it just easily... I've actually already washed this um, five times in the last two weeks. Not because it needed it five times, but because I wanted to make sure that it was durable in the washing machine. Um, so I've washed it five times. There's no, um, I get these little fuzzies that come off of the inside, but um, they're actually from the material that's around the zipper. And it's, it's like, it's like the edges where they cut it um, have a few little frays, but they're not, it's not pulling off the material. It's just fraying off from the seam and then they fall off. Um, but they don't, it doesn't make a hole or anything like that. I, don't, I hope that's 
explaining it well enough to it's it's nothing to do with um, those little fuzzies aren't anything to do with like the bed falling apart or the material coming apart it's just these t small little frays on the end that um, when you wash it they they fall off and I'm sure once you wash it and dry it a few times um, you know probably within the next few times that I dry it or wash it and dry it those will all be gone and I won't have any more um, for the rest of the life of the bed so anyway I washed this five times it's held up wonderfully no issues it's easy to get back on the bed um, one thing I was worried about was that I would wash it and it would not be able to stretch over this giant bed anymore it, I had no problem with it um, you know really I mean as far as I'm concerned, this is the highest quality dog bed that you're going to find on the market. The materials are top quality. Um, another great thing about this is it's made in America, which I love to look for products that are made here in the United States. It supports our economy here um, and, and provides jobs for uh, American citizens. So I really, I, I love that um, this company doesn't outsource to other countries um, and it's made here in America. The other thing that you can do is uh, you can, um, waterproof your dog's bed if you want to there's a hospital gain hospital grade foam protecting waterproof liners that you can buy so if you have um an older dog like like i said if you have this for 10 years we have a boxer who's six right now in 10 years if she's still around she'll be 16 years old she probably will have a bit of incontinence issues by then um, so if you have an older dog with incontinence if you have a puppy or something like that um, and you want a waterproof liner you can purchase those as well so a lot of great accessories a lot of great options really you can customize a bed for your dog's needs um, and aside from that major major expense um, really the absolute highest quality bed that you're going to find from Big Barker. So you can check out their website um, and find some more information on there if you want more details. I do have pictures. Uh, if you're watching this on YouTube, in the description below, there's a link to um, my written review. And uh, if you're on Top Dog Tips, you can scroll down a little bit and you'll see the pictures of my dogs loving and enjoying this bed. I, I literally had to bring this outside in the heat to get them away from the bed so that I could do this review and show you guys the bed because they were packed on here. Um, it fits our 65 pound boxer, our 80 pound chocolate lab, and our little beagle tucks in there sometimes. Um, the cats join them sometimes on this bed. So it, there's plenty, plenty of room. You can tell again, um, you know, I'm a full size adult and there's room enough for another adult on here or my dogs, both of my dogs could still fit on here, both of our large breeds with me. Um, so there's plenty, plenty of room. And um, if you have an extra, extra large dog, like a big giant St. Bernard or a Newfie or something, um, you could always go with the giant size so that he will have plenty of room as well. Um, so if you have any comments, questions, concerns about this review or the Big Barker bed, uh, by all means, get in touch with me. And um, if you have any products that you haven't found on our website that you'd like to see a review on or any videos, uh, how-to videos or any advice or anything like that that you'd like some more information on, I'd be happy to help out. You can email me at Samantha at TopDogTips.com. You can find us on social media. We're on Facebook, Twitter, Google+, um, Instagram, of course, our YouTube channel. And you can find us on our website, which is TopDogTips.com. My contact info is there as well. Any comments you leave anywhere on social media or on our website will get back to me. And I'll make sure that I uh, get any answers for you that you might be looking for. Um, again, if you like this review or you um, are interested in seeing anything else, jump on our website and check around you can subscribe to our youtube channel or our newsletter through our website uh, like us and follow us on social media and you will get updates on all the latest reviews that i post every week uh, we do giveaways every other week i post how-to videos every week and product comparisons um, so be sure to follow us and you can stay up to date with all of that i hope you guys enjoyed this review and i will see you back next time with another great product thanks